Man, do you remember that 40 pound cat, Meow? Well, unfortunately, over the weekend, he passed away. Yeah, I know, I'm, I'm sad like you guys are too. But to cheer you up, here's a video of a guy getting hit by a bus. So I guess these are students here from the University of Texas and they're having a foam sword fight. So we're gonna keep your eyes on the crowd up front here and particularly on this guy. Oh my God, did you see that? I mean, I think he was wearing an Obama mask. So if you pause the video, there's like this one frame where he looks back and yeah, there he is wearing an Obama mask. Man, I bet you Republicans everywhere saw this video and were like, yes, Obama just got hit by a bus. Score. Wait, what? It was just a black guy. That's still pretty good. Oh, come on, I kid the Republicans. Now, the kid's name was Nick. Now, according to this article in the New York Daily News, he was released from the hospital that same afternoon, although I don't see how he survived that. Look at that. Man, college is tough these days. Like, back when I went to Columbia, like, all we did was eat jello shots and face each other. And that was just the professors. Speaking of wanting to throw myself in front of a bus, Mother's Day is coming up. And that reminds me, of the special relationship between me and my man. All right, you see these pigs here? All right, so there's me, and there is my man's alcoholic boyfriend. So they're beginning to wean off then. Oh. Oops, oh. <laughs> Man, but when that pig flies, he makes a really great sound, like, like a squeak toy. It does remind you of that one, that one nursery rhyme, doesn't it? This little piggy went to the market. This little piggy stayed home. This little piggy ate roast beef. This little piggy had none. And this little piggy went, go! Oh my God, I can't wait to share this last one with you because this is seriously like the most gangster rap, street, hood, fucking shoot 'em up, badass rap you'll ever see in your life, ever. Ever. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the poetic stylings of Krispy Kreme. Krispy Kreme 2012. Cause I am the baddest of them all. If you ain't about money, then I don't mess with y'all. I made out with so many girls. I made out with every girl in the world. I have 400 cars. I have 400 scars and 400 guitars. I have 400 houses. I bet you you don't know two plus two. It's four, it's four. That was pretty badass. And you can't really appreciate the poetic stylings of Krispy Kreme until you analyze his lyrics. I fought two lions in one. And I don't even carry a gun. But you are holding a, you have a in the, I don't, I mean, I guess you don't want to argue with a guy like Krispy Kreme, because uh, according to him, he's pretty badass. I'm tough as nails. You're slower than a snail. I beat up every single person in jail. He beats up everyone in jail? <laughs> Is Krispy Kreme the same kid that had the Kool-Aid on his lips? You orange flavor mother I made out with so many girls. I made out with every girl in the world. Really? Every girl in the world? All three and a half billion of them? Like even Susan Boyle? Even your grandmother? Jelly? Dang, to impress all those ladies, Krispy Kreme must have a lot of money and assets. I have 400 cars. I have 400 scars and 400 guitars. I have 400 houses. I have 400 mouses and 400 houses. 400 houses? That's impressive. But you know what you could really use? A Kleenex. One Kleenex. A napkin. A paper towel. Your sleep. You have a fucking boogie, sir, is what I'm trying to say, and you need to get it, because it's bothering me. And if that ain't enough, man, old Krispy Kreme's gonna school you in some math. I bet you you don't know two plus two. It's four. It's four. He's right. Two plus two is in fact, it's four, it's four. No, but seriously, I think Krispy Kreme's most profound lyric is when he goes, uh, 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 u
No, come on guys, seriously, we can't rag on Krispy Kreme for having fun. But you know what? Man, Krispy Kreme is right. Whether you're getting hit by a city bus or getting smacked the f up by your mother's alcoholic boyfriend, when you get hit, you gotta get back up and put up a fight. And if I may, quote from Sir Krispy Kreme himself, I dare you to try and punch me. My face is so hard, you'll say ouch. You crunched me. Ouch! You crunched me! Go watch the whole video of Krispy Kreme. It's, it's awesome. Trust me, it's worth it. So I'm really excited about this. We're starting this new thing. Actually, it's not new. We've, we've done it on breaking before. If you leave your Skype username in the comment section below or on Facebook, Twitter, wherever, uh, we might uh, call you and you'll end up at the end of Equals 3. I'll see you guys in a few days! What's up, man? Hey, how's it going? What's up? Uh, you got a kitty! Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. What's your name? Anthony. What do you What do you do, man? Uh, I'm at school, university, taking engineering. That's dope. That's one of those few majors that'll put you right into a job. Yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> yeah, it's not like literature and shit where you got to go unemployed forever. <laughs> well, I wanted to ask you a question though. Um, what is the most annoying thing your cat does? Um, I have a, a, a couch that I saved up money for, and yeah, it is not worth the money that I spent on it after. <laughs> All right, Anthony. All right. Take it easy. Bye, Jade. See, see ya. Bye. Please support cancer research. Thank you. Jupiter, you're